Hey, Jeremy picked us up. And he says he's gonna take us up to Indian Springs. There's a restaurant up there called Yohala Creek. I think that's where he's gonna drop us off at first. Uh, see y'all when we get there. Now we're at Yahala Creek Restaurant. So me and Amanda are here to eat brunch. We've had it here before on Mother's Day and it was really good. We usually are here for, for dinner. I'd say they probably have one of the best dinners at any restaurant in the state. So you like this, Amanda? I love this, one of my favorite restaurants. So if you ever get a chance, come to the village in Indian Springs and try out Yahala Creek Restaurant. brunch at Yahala Creek was actually really good. Didn't you enjoy that? I all? loved it, yes. And now he says he's going to drive us over to Indian Springs. But I told him we could probably walk, but he insisted that uh, he drive us over there. I think he just really loves driving us. So now we're on our way to Indian Springs State Park. Hey, we're here in Indian Springs at Georgia's Fountain of Youth right here. So we we'll reach down and get some water. Give some to Amanda, and we're gonna drink this Fountain Youth water in Georgia, Indian Springs, Georgia. Okay, get your gallon. Come on. Thank you. Woo, that's good. Hey, we just drank our water. I feel a whole lot better already. Amanda, how about you? Feel great. And if it you wasn't as bad as it normally has been. Yeah, it didn't have as much sulfur in it today. It seems like, but if you look in the building behind us, that's where the spring is and you can see all of the containers people bring up here to fill up with water and it, anytime you come up here there's gonna be somebody down there just filling up as many containers as they can and I think they believe it makes them live healthier who knows all right here we are by the river at Indian Spring State Park it's the oldest state park in uh State of Georgia, is it the oldest? Yeah. And and the first. The first state park. Yeah. This is Vogel was on around the same time that this was coming. In the state of Georgia. But as a kid, uh, I remember being brought up here and standing on these rocks, wading in the water on hot days, to kind of stay cool. And just a pretty place. If you get a chance to come up here, I highly recommend it. at the lake at Indian Springs. It's a great place to come kayak, paddle board. Uh, I don't think they'll let you swim in it, although I've seen Chandler and Cassie swim in it. They rented a kayak from the base that had a leak in it way across the lake and pretty much had to swim back tugging that kayak with them. I'll also say Indian Springs is a good place to come camping if you want to detox from technology because there ain't no cell phone signal here and it's a really good place just to come and enjoy nature. Uh, I think Amanda will agree with me. Yep, yep, and great place to come picnic as well. Yes. Jeremy says he's got a surprise for us, some, some gas station. He said that we'll be surprised surprised in that, uh, I don't know what is so special about this gas station, but he'll, he'll take us there and we'll share that with y'all. Hey, Jeremy drove us up here to the Sack of Suds. He said this was actually filmed in the movie My Cousin Vinny. And in that movie, the character portrayed by Ralph Macchio may have stole a can of tuna out of here, but he got charged with murder. And his cousin Vinny, Joe Pesci, had to come down here and get him out of jail. Right here along the banks of the Old Muggy River, Jackson, Georgia. Yeah, that gas station, Sack of Suds, that was interesting. Uh, I actually met the owner and he was very friendly and told us about a ramp he built down going toward the river. You can pull up, drop your kayaks off, and he says you're free to park in his parking lot. He said just be real careful not to pull up on his grass down there. But if y'all get a chance, you want to float down the Oak Muggy River, I highly recommend you go to the left, not the right. We've done that. You ask any roughing about it, they'll tell you. Go to the left, don't go to the right. So now I think Jeremy's probably 
taking us up to the Lloyd Shoals Dam where the Oak Muggy River starts. Hey everybody, Jeremy drove us over here to the Lloyd Shoals Dam, Jackson, Georgia. Behind that wall is Lake Jackson. The actual Oak Muggy River starts right here. Goes down, everybody's familiar with the Oak Muggy River, goes through Macon, joins up with the Oconee and becomes the Altamaha River. But if you look around, just a bunch of damn rocks everywhere. That's a lot of damn rocks we've been walking over. I'm tired. I think I'm ready for us to go back and and see Jeremy. Jeremy's going to, I guess, drive us wherever else Jeremy drives us. I don't know where he's going to drive us to, but looking forward to getting back in that truck. All right, so we've been all over, enjoyed everything we've seen, and I think we're both tired and looking forward to getting home. How about yourself? Yeah, I'm exhausted. Tired. So yeah, Jeremy's gonna drive us home and can't wait to get home, kick our shoes off and throw our feet up. But y'all have a great week. See y'all next week. <laughs>